Hey there, everybody. This is Bob out on Black Betty, my 2020 Electroglide. Just out doing a little bit of a, a jaunt. It's a, another gorgeous day. Just taking a little bit of a ride through some country, some woods, and Not really, really anything too technical. Got some bikes out today. Everybody's enjoying the weather. This is a nice quiet road, a little bit of traffic. Usually neither for anything too very much shoot. Just a little bit of windy roads going around uh, Lake Thurman. And uh, just trying to get used to this uh, LS2 helmet. I really didn't think it was, but uh, shoot, my other full face helmet is a uh, HJC. This thing, in all honesty, feels like it weighs about twice as much, maybe a little more. But, uh, the protection is worth it. Plus the versatility, you know, being a modular, you can just flip the whole thing up, ride with a half, three-quarter helmet, or, you know, got the sun visor down on it today, which really wearing glasses is, uh, just the ticket but um, I don't think it'll be too bad I switch helmets like underwear good grief HDR was right he had me uh, I was going to get a uh, the new Cena, and uh, he said, "Shoot, just buy the the mount and microphones and headphones and everything, and just put them in the helmet, and move the camera back and forth." And uh, that, that seems to work good. Seems like I'm switching the camera every day, <laughs> but. Uh, I really appreciate all the support and subscribers and everybody that's been reaching out to me. This is one strong community. It, uh, just the friendship goes pretty deep. I know there's been some discussion about why do you do it. I've said it before. I do it to share what I like doing. If somebody catches it, takes a look, decides they want to try it, shoot fire, ride the motorcycles. It's just uh, therapeutic. I don't think there's an age limit. 
everybody knows their own limits. Uh, you know, everybody shoot again, catch HDR, Colin, Bronco Ride, uh, Bob, Bodied 52, their fireside chat with the boys every Sunday is, uh, most Sundays, I take that back, they, uh, did it on a Saturday last week because of uh, Mother's Day. I was out of town and didn't participate. I think this is maybe the first one I've ever missed. But, uh, it's always a great way to uh, get ready for the week ahead. A lot of fun. A lot of useful information. A lot of great people for guests. On top of the hosts, which I think are uh, three of the best. But, uh, a lot of people out on boats today. I, uh, when Harriet died, that was my big, uh, decision. I'd been off motorcycle for 18 years, maybe 18 plus, good grief, I don't know. But, uh, just to get out of the house and, uh, you know, it was, I was going to buy a camper, a boat, or a motorcycle. I've had a boat. I know it's a hole in the water you pour money into camper, I figured, shoot, how often would I use it? And a motorcycle I could pretty much use every day. So I can't remember who sang it. Uh, Willie Nelson, maybe? On the road again? But I'm glad I did. For one thing, just everybody that's uh, involved in this community. And I'm old, I wouldn't remember everybody's name. I probably would, but you know, I'm not gonna mess up any of them. Uh, are always there to help, to greet. Uh, it's just worth its weight. Like I say, it's a hobby. It's uh, you don't have to do it. As a matter of fact, the ride I took out to uh, get my breakfast this morning, I just didn't even didn't record any of it. So I don't ride to do a video. I did the videos because I like what I do. And I like to share it. I didn't know if I had ever mentioned it, but I did put a pin lock in this, uh, this helmet, and I am impressed. It, uh, talk about anti-fogging, it was worth its weight, I'll tell you that. It'll be interesting to see what, what it's like when it warm or cools down. 
and uh, you know when the fog really sometimes is is uh, more prevalent but uh, shoot everybody with a full face helmet I would sincerely suggest doing it and uh, Got a motorcycle, get out there and ride, be safe, enjoy life, and tell somebody you care. <laughs>